coming. Uh, I just had a discussion with uh, with uh, fellow citizens in the Guard, Reserve, and Active Duty who've been in both Iraq and Afghanistan. And thank you for sharing your uh, insights with me. Thank you for your service to the country. I told uh, these men and women that uh, their service is uh, necessary for the security of the United States of America uh, and that they're serving in, uh, in historic times. And one day their children will be able to look back and say, so my dad, my mom, went to Iraq and Afghanistan and helped their young country become a democracy. And therefore the world is more peaceful for us. One of the things I am going to do is I'm going to meet with the family members of these, uh, of these groups and, and express our country's gratitude uh, for their service as well. A lot of times military families don't get proper thanks. And I can't wait to, to meet, your, meet your loved ones and tell them firsthand that the country uh, appreciates your service. One thing I told these, uh, these good folks is that this country stands with the people who are in our nation. We're with you. We know the work is hard, but the work is necessary, and we're winning. And we're winning. And, uh, and the world's going to be better off because of your courageous service. And I thank you for it. Thanks for letting me come back and visit you. I appreciate it.